The Advanced School for Smart Learning interacted with global developments by adopting the latest educational methods in the world. It found that among these methods is the integration between the different sciences of mathematics, technology, and engineering, which is a system that is called globally STEM. In order to activate this methodology, it was necessary to create a community of students and their teachers that embraced and developed their ideas. The idea of establishing a department for projects and artificial intelligence was one of the requirements for activating the STEM methodology, learning through projects, and adopting student assistance in providing equipment and tools and acquiring various skills through various training units. Training Modules 1. The Robot Lab 2. The Robot Club for Middle and High School Students 3. Academy of Robotics and Artificial Intelligence 4. Fab Lab Five Aviation Laboratory Six Science Laboratories Seven Creativity and Innovation Center The department specializes in the following 1. Applying the project-based learning methodology in the form of capstone projects. 2. Employing the robot as one of the assistive technology tools for the teacher in the classroom. 3. Training teachers on engineering and technological skills that enable them to integrate technology and engineering into learning activities. 4. Training students through the Fab Lab team to use Fab Lab machines to help students implement project models. 5. Adopting the training of students to participate in local and international competitions in the field of robotics, artificial intelligence, scientific research and scientific projects. 6. Contribute to external exhibitions to introduce and publicize schools. Next up, let's see Saudi Arabia at the center of the stage. Seven, supervising the implementation of STEM Day. The aim of the STEM Day program is to enhance the intellect, habits, and abilities of students through scientific experiments in science, mathematics, technology, and engineering. We have evaluated our experience in smart learning schools over the past three years, and this has led to the need to implement a program that bridges the gap between traditional and non-traditional educational methods that rely on allow students to work through a functional space in which students can collaborate, innovate, invent and solve problems. This method creates a fun and engaging learning environment that helps students feel comfortable about participating in scientific activities. The more they participate, the more scientifically educated they become. Students who are educated in this manner become young adults with career prospects in prominent industries. The Smart Learning Academy for Robotics and Artificial Intelligence is a meeting place for students of smart learning schools and other schools to prepare teams that represent schools, the Riyadh region, and the kingdom in robot competitions. The academy is the fruit of the qualitative achievements of smart learning schools at the local and global levels in the field of robotics and artificial intelligence. The academy includes different types of robots and computers that enable different teams and tracks to compete in many competitions with high professionalism, at a level that we are proud of at the global level. The academy is characterized by the diversity of different ages of students, from the initial stages of primary school to high school students. It includes 60 students who have morning and evening training. The Academy has a complementary role in the basic educational process in smart learning schools, as it is there. I was in the field of robots with my friends Nawaf and Barwad. I was the driver of the second and the hardware that is the banner robot. I was in the shooting and the shooting and the hand that is the shooting. I was in the hardware and I was a human player. I was in the field of the hardware. هذه المكان الروبوت أول مباراة، بهذه الأحداث مكان خطأ 
يخرب شغل الروبوت في باقي المباراه الان المركز الاول على مستوى المملكه للالهام فريق رقم 19127 مدينه الرياض STEM Aeronautics Laboratory. It is known that the STEM methodology works to expand students' perceptions in various fields, and the field of aviation is one of the areas that attracts students' minds towards thinking about the principles of flight and how things fly by defying gravity. Various aviation phenomena inspire students to think about excellent projects, ideas, and innovations. Rather, these ideas can be used on a larger level in the field of space and aviation despite their simplicity.